but it's brilliant to have you work here. Thank you. Um, the title of your exhibition is A Natural Geographic. Mm -hmm. Would you like to explain a bit more about what that means? Yeah, I can. Uh, basically, the name came as a sort of a source of inspiration, basically, for my latest body of work, which is basically taken from National Geographic magazines. Um, obviously, the National Geographic magazines, all the images, all the imagery, basically, I use, I've reworked it. Um, and that transformed them in something else. So obviously, uh, they are far from natural, um, as I explained in the text of the exhibition as well. Uh, they become some sort of other nature or other um, concepts or other appreciations of nature can be. Um, and it's also pretty much as well about the interlinks between human being, uh, technology and nature, and how basically we um, create or adjust our concepts about these things as well in a world nowadays that we have, which is a contemporary society with within all the values are constantly shifting. So how do we adjust ourselves with that as well? So that's why the unnatural geographic kind of thing more. I noticed that for this exhibition you have quite a lot of collage work. Mm -hmm. Do you have a specific medium that you favour most? Um, I think I'm quite diverse in my practice actually to be honest. I like to explore different medias. Even in this show itself I have a piece of sculpture, I have another piece which is slightly more interactive as well. Um, so they kind of change a little bit as well gradually with the time. Um, I also have Photoshop and collages also and the main reason why I have uh, traditional collages and Photoshop is because of the contrast between the two of them because you have a traditional collage that looks like Photoshop mm -hmm. and a Photoshop collage that looks like a traditional one. So there's sort of a shift there somehow as well and I like to question and challenge the viewers as well to kind of uh, try to discover more or less how the things have been done instead of kind of giving everything as granted. So what kind of plans do you have at the moment for the future? For the future, I have another show coming up in London. Um, I'm applying for residencies out of uh, the UK as well at the moment. I have another one coming soon in Amsterdam. Um, and basically, I mean, I'm kind of solidifying, I think, sedimenting a bit more my practice as well. And hopefully, I have the chance to do that for now as well. <laughs> so, finally, um, just a bit more of a quirky question. Could you please sum up your style in three words? I cannot. <laughs> I absolutely <laughs> cannot. <laughs> Actually, as you can see, my practice is quite diverse anyhow. <laughs> so I think that's probably a little bit of a tricky question <laughs> for me to answer. Thank you for your Thank time. you so much, lovely. Thank Fantastic. You.